Okay. Let's refresh. Alright, so Vitalectrics. Normally the guy falls over and then puts a thumbs up. That's like their logo. But in this game he doesn't put his thumbs up because he fell on his sword. So he just dies. This is a Homestar Runner game. It started as a game that Strong Bad was playing in a random speed mail, and then they made an actual game out of it, based on Trogdor. Play tall ball, I eat chocolate. Let's get this dank story. Um, as long as you move, it'll beat Ryu Jump Short. It won't beat Jump Short at all ranges, but as long as you walk to the correct range, it should be fine. Look tree, or just plain look. Talk man, get item. Use item, give item, throw item, some other action words. Even if it's your inventory, safe to save the game and load to load. Plus and minus to speed up or slow down your character. I forgot that was a feature. How's the volume? Our name is Rather Dashing. Scalding Lake only to find the Trogdor of the Bernadette has Bernadette your thatched roof cottage, along with all your goods and services. And a wingling dragon. The reason the YouTube guys, I mean the YouTube, the uh, Homestar Runner guys stopped is because, uh, <laughs> start playing in a second here. Uh, they had kids. They like both had kids, I think. Okay, go for it. Press return to advance through conversations. I can only allow actual peasants up the mountain pass to face Trogdor, and you're clearly not one. You don't stink like a peasant, you don't dress like a peasant, and you're definitely not on fire like a peasant. Once you do those three things, come back and maybe we can talk. Hmm. I think this game loops vertically, but not horizontally. So if you go down far enough, you'll go up, and vice versa. Holler at the old man about Trogdor, but he just grumbles about the fish not biting. Must be using the wrong bait, he says suggestively. Lewd. Gone fishing. Just like that grog at Koozie, your cousin got you. You open her up and head in. Hello. But the lady cuts you off. My husband got squished by Trogdor and to make matters worse. The insurance riches I got were stolen by the Jonka. Go and steal them back for us and I'll give you something great. The baby lady calls after you. Hey, you're on some quest, right? This little squirt lost something combined in the yard the other day. See if you can find it. They all just squish in your hands. Nothing but squished berries. Too bad you don't want any squished berries, because hey, jackpot. It's always the last one you check. A super trinket. You have a sneaking suspicion that someone in this game will need this thing. I got points. There's my super trinket. It looks like something, but I don't know what. It was weird. Favorite t-shirt ever. Canoeing, fishing, stoning heathens, what a blast. I guess we'll look at the tree. You're really hurting for puzzle solutions, huh? There's the well. What you actually do in this well. That doesn't like me going in through this side. I 
I'm Mendelev, says the archer. I used to run a shooting range here with my brother Dongolev, but we don't even talk anymore. I haven't seen him in a Jonka's age. Tell him I said Heldo. You mean hello? I said Heldo, I meant Heldo. Tell him I said Heldo. If you go and talk to his brother before you get told to say Heldo, and then you say Heldo. Take pebbles. Surreptitious rocks. Um, the game will criticize you for using game FAQs. Oh shit, it's the Carrick. Where is he, damn it? Talk to Carrick. Me. Miyamo Julia Julio only seems to further anger the already temperamental Carrick. Learn Carrick in three weeks. Cassette did nothing. By Carrick, a cold one. Carrick is a. How do you pronounce that? Teetotaler? Teetotaler? I've never known. It's offended by your offer. You've really cheesed him off now. He starts moving faster if you do that. Whoa, shit! I guess I'll press plus. That's my house. Oh. You startled him and he disappears. There's something with that guy, but I forget what you can do with him. Thy Dungeon Man is an extremely good game. Two and three are like actual good games. I guess I can move this rock, but I can't do anything yet. Slide the stone. Scared of Carrick, go away. J. J is the Jonka. So we've got, we've basically, uh, I guess I'll talk to the donkey. Met with horse grunts and tail flaps. It's not so easy. That's poor Gary. So I've got a lot of stuff that I can't, like, do yet. Let me up here, come on. It'd be kind of embarrassing to have them shoot around with them. Can't just steal an arrow from here. You plunk all your pebbles into the bucket. The weight causes it to descend to the bottom of the well with a quickness. The crank seems to have loosened and you haul the bucket back up. What's this? Why, there's a monster mascus in there. No doubt left over from some, some pagan ritual. This thing could scare a horse! We lost the pebbles. Gray chicken feed. And there's the monster mascus. Deering masks evil uncle. Whoa, Carrick. You slip on the hideous monster mascus. the crap out of poor Gary. You can die by getting in the way of these arrows. He will kill you. Hello. He must want to start the old business back up. Now you have an arrow. Game is comfy. Where is he? Do you so sub bot? What? How 
Aldo. Test your skill. Give us the right super item from your inventory and you can give it as many tries as you need. That'll work. Just hit three balls eyes and you win the super fun time funbo TM. Super time funbo TM. You don't give lessons so you're on your own. Bonk. Damn. You've got you need three balls eyes and five shots. But I'm bad at video games. So I think I've already failed. But you can try infinitely. Damn it. You need dead on shots. That red bar. Been a while. Oh my god, I'm so bad at video games. This is the run. Never mind. Alright. This won't take me an hour, guys, I promise. Shit. It might. It might take me an hour. I remember where to aim it horizontally. I'm just missing the fucking timing of these space bar presses. God damn it. I got this guys, I promise. Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. I got this. This is the run. Never mind, not the run. <gasps> Thank god. Three hits, here's your prize. We don't sell MOC up to find your own arrows. Let's queue up my my command here. Die, motherfucker. Here goes nothing, Kid Icarus. Bodied. Arrowed. Nice shot. You have smoked the Carrick. He lay there stinking. Light rain heralds the washing free of Carrick's grip on the land. You're feeling pretty good, though, so the artless symbolism doesn't bug you. Serious Carrick Brant cooties on it. He does smell real bad, but he's a bit too big to fit in your pocket. I got his belt. You strapped the Carrick's belt buckle around your waist. Oh boy, you still stink now. So now I smell like a peasant. Now I just need to look like a peasant, or dress like a peasant, and then also be on fire like a peasant. Also, if you come back to the map where Carrick was later on, he's like bones. Mud. Oh no. This is from the rain. I think you can only get one arrow ever. Hide in hay. Oh. You leap in the hay like a two years old boy. The hay sticks to your muddy body. You're a walking hay bale. I knew a lot of shows that did this. Nice disguise, the Jonka doesn't seem to notice you. I feel like the Jonka can kill you, but I don't remember the Jonka ever killing me. I like this. Take riches. Oh, oh, a stiff freeze blew all the hay and surprisingly the mud off you. You take my riches, girl, the Jonka? No. Okay, let me know if you see riches anywhere. I need the character's body. Yeah, there it is. He wasn't fat, he was just big boned.
my riches. Snatches up every last gold coin. Thanks, sucker. Here you go. She shoves the baby into your hands and bolts out the door. He later learned that all this time she wanted throughout the countryside. Those riches probably were the Jonkas, and who knows whose baby that is. Well, it's yours now. You see this stuff like crazy when you were a kid and your parents weren't watching, which is all too often. This place is dead anyway. So now we have the baby. Peasant babies are adorable. No wonder they fetch such a pretty penny on the black market. The Carrick belt. Things like all got out. Why couldn't the Carrick have kidnapped a hot wench or something you could have saved? Got a chicken feed. Pretty fancy bow. You're surprised those shitty archers gave away such a decent prizes. Goldfish in a bag. Riches, dude, riches. That peasant lady totally has to share some of this with you, right? At least that shiny clawed scepter thing. Alright. There's a bunch of things you can do with the baby. Toss the feed into the lake. You should a gear tier for each one. A bunch of other stuff we didn't animate. Get a room. Not yet. Show baby. Look at that little guy. You want to treat, do you? What a baby's like. How about my medication? Nice. Alright, this is my favorite. Here we go. Throw baby. Something tells you this is a good idea and you lob the little one into the lake. You won't be arrested after all. The little guy has resurfaced safely, carrying an old bottle of soda. You take the soda and stow your swaddling buddy for takeoff. Put baby in bucket. Okay, father of the year. You put the baby in a bucket and it quickly descends deep into the... well... Yours is a black, black heart. You haul the bucket back up. Luckily for you, the baby is still in it and appears to be unscathed. As a bonus, it looks like you found a meatball sub down there. Oh, and the baby. You take the baby. <laughs> so let's take a look at our inventory now. We've got the soda and the meatball sub. And also the pills. Where are the pills? Inkeeper's medication, general oldness, may cause checkers playing hiked up pants and overall pee smell. Piping hot meatball sub fresh from the bottom of a dingy old well. Bag of chips and you've got a combo. Full bottle of popular soda. Deploy baby. Deploying Q baby. You have to do all the baby stuff before you do that. It's the last thing you can do with the baby. He got the college door open and headed off to a new life. He becomes the valedictorian of his graduating class, goes to Scalding Lake State, gets a degree in advanced peasantry and learns a job at Thatch Pro, building better cottages for a better tomorrow. You grow apart from the letters, become fewer and fewer. He develops a severe mead problem and blames you for never being there. So last we see the baby. Vintage peasant robe in there, just like Grandpa used to wear. Clothes dresser. You get a point for that. How thoughtful and boring of you. Break into this peasant's home, steal his clothes, and remember to tidy up after yourself. You're a real saint.
Can't even take the bunny carrot. Shake my damn head. I think I've done pretty much everything there is to do in this overworld. Slip into the vintage robe, it smells like grandpa's lap. Now you're looking like a serious peasant. So now we smell like a peasant and look like a peasant. Get our room. Just bed on down for the night and I'm sure I'll remember to collect the fee in the morning. Night falls like a bad PowerPoint presentation. You sleep for maybe 20 minutes before the extreme pain in your spine forces you to get up. I recognize that painting back there. It's like the dogs playing poker. Old man Rob. Big black pot of horse grease on the top shelf. Oh no. Can't see a thing in your head is covered in highly flammable horse grease. You better get out of here before that disgusting old man comes back. Your controls are like not reversed, but they don't. They're like turned 40 degrees. I mean, 40, 90 degrees. Let's grab the big black pot and wipe the horse grease from your eyes. Part of your robe is still covered in highly flammable horse grease, though. Whoa, the horse grease on your robe caught fire. You're for a real peasant now. I think I don't have anything left to do here. Don't need to use that now. I don't know if I've gotten every point, but we're just going to go on. We're still missing four items, which is an uncomfortable amount. I feel like I should be missing three. Oh well. Please insert floppy disk 2 into drive B and press enter. It just lets you in. Climb. New determination, you dig your fingers into the cliff face and begin to haul yourself up like... haul yourself the mountain like you were in a sports drink commercial. If you're near the top, a rock can just fall on you, which is pretty annoying. I don't think they kill you, I think they just knock you back down to the base. Oh my god. Oh no, I died. Auto save on the mountain pass. Have a refreshing coffee, relax, and come back and try again, maybe. Good thing for auto saves. It can be really hard to get out of the way of a boulder if you're just unlucky. If one spawns directly over your head, especially when you're near the top, you're just fucked. Yay. Take bone. Take skull. Whatever. Polish peasant, you have to explain your. Oh, you explain you're here to smoke Trogdor. Kind of a way of him too. Only three keepers of Trogdor hold the tools which to destroy the Brennator. Unless you have something to eat on you. Give sub. Alright, I got the Trog shield. I don't even know what the questions are. Give soda. My lower back. Give medicine. So I think I'm still missing an item. So I, I didn't do something that I could have done. 
don't know what. Oh well. The beaded curtain slams shut behind you. I love how small you are in the scene. Drug door so big. Oh. I died. You hurl the Trog's orb with all your might. The beefy arm, dude. Oh crap, that's you whimpering. Talk. You scream that your name is rather dashing Trogdor Brennan aid your cottage and you're here for revenge. Congratulations, you've won. No one can kill Trogdor, but you've come closer than anybody ever. Way to go. I got the full, I got the perfect score. The baby. The Carrick, the Jonka. Yes, the statue. Nice work on winning. find out what that last item was. We'll never find out. Hold on, I'm gonna go check out the games menu. Wii games, Stinko Comics, Song Bad's cool game for attractive people demo. Dangerous. that's a good game. Dungeon Man 3. I think I'll play that Dungeon Man. I could play Secret Collect. That game's like 50 levels long. Let me check out the old games to remember what I'm looking at. It's off screen right now, I know. Play some Die Dungeon Man. It's like there. It's like to enter Yon Dungeon. Die Dungeon Man, you are Die Dungeon Man. You find yourself in Yon Dungeon. You see a scroll. Behind you scroll is a flask. Obvious exits are north, south, and Dennis. Get ye flask. You cannot get ye flask. It is firmly bolted to a wall which is bolted to the rest of the dungeon which is probably bolted to a castle. 
whatever you mind. Get ye flask. Get ye flask. Okay, okay, you unbolt yon flask and hold it aloft. A great shaking begins. The dungeon ceiling collapses down on you, crushing you in twain. Apparently this was a load-bearing flask. I got negative 998 points. Get dagger. Yeah, okay. You head south to an embankment or maybe a chasm. You can't decide which. You spies a trinket. Take ye trinket. You get Zion trinket and discover it to be a bauble. You rejoice at your good fortune. You shove the trinket into your pouchal. It kind of hurts. Dennis. You arrive at Dennis. He wears a sporty frock coat and a long jimber jam. Paces about nervously. Talk to Dennis. You learn his jimber jam was purchased on sale at a discount market and he enjoys pacing about nervously. You become bored and begin thinking about parapets. Give... Dennis, you trick it. A novel idea. You givest the trinket to Dennis and he happily agrees to tell you what parapets are. With this new knowledge, ye escapes from your own dungeon to a search for new dungeons and to remain thy dungeon man. You hath won, congratulation. That's the only way to win, is to get the trinket and to give it to Dennis. Oh, you can't even... Okay, I've got to refresh the page. There's one other thing you can do. This game is pretty basic. You arrive at parapets. You see a rope. Obvious exits are south. What are parapets? Take rope. It glows a mustard red and smells like a public privy. Privy? Passed on your neck and hangs you from the parapets. With your last breath, you wonder what parapets are. Apparently, at some point in the past, the brothers chaps were playing a text-based game where knowledge of what parapets were was essential to beating the game, and they didn't know what parapets were. And this game is vaguely a parody of that. Also, I've now done literally everything you can do in this game. The Dungeon Man is a pretty basic bitch game. Let me see if there's any other games. I mean, obviously, there's um, Stinker Man 20XD6. Where's the running game? Where's where's an egg? I wanna play some where's an egg. I don't remember how big the window is supposed to be for this one. Let's just try this. This is probably not the right size. That's about the right size. I've got a little bit of extra space on the left. Where is an egg? Alright, we met the cat lady. Tell me about the egg. She doesn't know where the egg is. Whenever you ask people about themselves, they just smile. Okay, this guy is lying. This guy is a liar. I think randomly three people will be lying or three people will be telling the truth. I don't care about this. This lady probably doesn't know where the egg is. That lady was lying too. Red hat guy. In the blue area. He's right. Best. Let's figure out if he's telling the truth. He seems to be a truth teller. Everything he's saying seems to be factually accurate. And he says the egg is in the bag, which belongs to the red hat guy. Blammo. 
Found the egg. Fucking Sputnik, dude. The really shitty Russian writing everywhere it makes this game all that much better. Music's pretty catchy too. Alright, speedrun strats. Got it! First try! Depending on how fast you are, you'll see different things at the end. There's a 1 in 9 chance. There's 9 people. I got lucky. So there's the first man in space. First man made object in space. First man in space. And then first space walk. Celebrating Russian space achievements. I want to get the game over screen too. If you kill someone and they don't have the egg, god damn it! I don't want the egg. If you kill someone and don't have the egg, there's literally no repercussions. However, your gun only has three bullets, and if you use all three bullets without finding the egg person, um. Oh yeah, you can ask the people, and they ask for medic. It was actually that guy. Oh, I'm in Siberia. There's literally no reason this game is in Russian. The game is, however, simple enough that it can be played. Where's that one running game? It's simple enough that it can be played, uh, even if you have no idea, even if you can't understand it. Fifty K Race Walker? That's a good one. That's not the one I wanted though. Kid Speedy, that's the one. 50k race walker is a good game. Take some steps. All the Homestar Runner games are pretty dank. Choose it out. I'm not quite Paul Phoenix going on here. Need my skin to closely match my. I want to look barefoot, damn it. Whatever. Enter your name, Race Walker. Alternate the left and right arrow keys. Don't walk too fast or you will fault. Walk 50k and you might win the race. Take a break if you start feeling faint or have to eat. You have to alternate hitting left and right, but if you go too fast, it faults you. to walk 50 kilometers.
All right, I'm done with this game. This game is shitty. There's a way you can beat that game. Let me beat it right now. So it's blonde, style C, skin this one, shirt is, what was it? Pink, shorts to medium blue. And then shoes are what? Shoes are black. Wait, that wasn't it? That's the upper left. I did the wrong blue. shoes black there I am Gary Palaroncini Chini it starts here at 49.99 Third place. Good game. Kid Speedy is like a better game entirely. Play some kid speedy, baby. Try not to get last place. Collect these for speed. Do speed with these. Online play. Pretty sure there is no online play. I regret picking it though. I like how one of them is definitely Indiana. The loop. It's the only stage that is in the loop. Demons rub. Probably flats. Walkathon. Eggy Mountain Minithon. Chop Wilds, SK, Cheese Puff Hills, Two Mile, Jelly Woods, Fun Run. So I have to collect healthy things and avoid unhealthy things. And all you have to do is not come in last place. It doesn't matter what position you come in as long as it's not last. Even if you get every good thing and miss every bad thing, you can still occasionally get, like, not. You can still occasionally be forced to be in last place. It's just very random. Hell yeah, qualified. Qualified. I probably won't do all of these. of this game are pretty funny. Unfortunately, you have to play the game a long time in order to see any of the endings. There's four different endings, too, because there's four different playable characters.
basically, when you come in not last place on every lap, it saves the orphanage. There, I spoiled it. The other playable characters are Strong Sad, the King of Town, and Humstar. Humstar is actually a good runner, so you can actually win with him. And Humstar, if he enters, he can win like a million dollars. Alright, let's play the other good point and click game. No kick. Nobody do anything dangerous. Roomish Roomisode, episode one, behind the danger desk. Click on stuff with your mouse to bring up the action menu. The fucking old ass Apple uh mouse clicker. Dangerous, you're out of line. Supposed to solve a case for him months ago. You're a loose cannon, a loner. When you're around, people get hurt, danger -esque. If you don't walk out of this case, walk out of the store with my case solved, I'm locking you up. i try and solve his case quick. There's an ashtray. The ash mirror is on E. Ashen faced. Your ash is grash. It's kind of a risque joke. Five year old takeout from Kung Fu Dragon. It's a cool picture of a dragon man doing Kung Fu on it. Stuck to the top of the safe. I need to hire a takeout stuck to safe cracker for this one. Looks safe, it looks safe. Crap dangle. Forgot the two digit combination. Maybe I wrote it down somewhere. Dangerous never plays it safe. Brogs at four thugs. This game is based. Looking at rectangulous rug. Hands up floor. Something faintly scribbled on the floorboards, can't make it out. Freeze dust mites. Go away, small part of floor. It says Iqsereng. There's a chief, chief thieving behind it. But I solve the chief's case first. Mines are keeping me from seeing the city at large. You got it, Hoss. The fat guy watching TV in that apartment over there. Can't hear me. Finally upgraded to the off. Leggy Dame stops by. Hands up floor. Aha. Uh -huh. This is a combination to my save, 73. Invisible glow in the dark ink. Alright, let's see what's in the safe. Serious compromising photographs of this baby. I didn't look at it, I should have. Um, keep doing your swing thing, man. Excuse me, my good lamp, do you know the times? This whole system is out of line. Fuck. High stamp. I need to waste myself closer. 
An unsolved stamp? Policy, how did policy help that poor innocent girl? Excellent things to say before slamming a desk. I'll see what I need to do to pretend solve you. Unknown mass assailant attacked victims at the Swiss Blancal Hotel, stealing documents, secrets, and notions. Left physical evidence at scene. Vomit up, Chuck. Who's it? Need photographic evidence of the attack. Need physical evidence of what was left behind. Need this case to have solved stamp on it. My faked ID is higher than this. Phone's there to take a proverbial bite out of proverbial crime. I need to use this though. Oh, I missed it. I want to read that again. Looks like I'm gonna have to jump. I jumped. I look ready for love, a gunfight, car chase, and a small sell it all at once. Make your real hot stuff around here, don't you, Danger esque? Hard new Kowalski. You're so manly and my husband the chief is spalding and football watchy. Let's keep making out. I'm not falling for that crap again. Gladys has been Gladys has been dead for thirty years. Sorry, the chief. Just kidding, no woman will come within twenty feet of me. Touche. Drank the old coffee. Can't slouch properly in a bed. Get on it. Shut up. Below the chair. Oh. We. Two year old creamer in that coffee doesn't mess around. Five, 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 Khufu. I like how it looks on the floor. Stay down. Strong bed, so cool. Kung Fu Dragon? I have a takeout tech support issue. Take support issue. I said Kiku. That's Japanese, though. Never know when you might need to make somebody puke. I think I've seen too much over the years. Sorry, take out. They said no loose ends. That was definitely one of the worst things I've ever done. I put the stamp in the uh, sweet and sour sauce. This game is great because everything has purpose. Here comes trouble. Send this down to the boys at the um lab. Got the bag of who's it? Hey, this stuff out a bit. right yeah look at that here's a shot I can use this is my photograph of the attack I like how it's strong sad yes I just beat pheasant's quest 
Put the bag of who's it. That's my evidence of the attack. Good enough for crooked government work. He used to say who's who's it is who's. Photo of crime. Alright, I've maxed up my score. Now we just need the unsolved stamp. Only get one shot at this. Solved. Almost as good as that time I turned to zero zero on an algebra test due to 1000%. <laughs> That's such a good gag. Here you go, Chiefy. Well, I need to come through danger esque. Your methods may be questionable, but you always get results. This is like Assy McGee without the risque. Assy McGee is like the greatest show. This isn't a picture of the victim. Who the crap's this grayscale schlub? Uh oh. Looks like I'm gonna have to jump! Red. <laughs> Unironically, a good game. Alright, that's enough of that. 